But we're off to find the dollar store or the dollar tree. I don't know where we're going. The only one I can find is about 20 minutes from here. I don't know. We will clock it. It should be about 15 with anyone else driving, but I'm really slow. Okie doke. Let's go check this out. I'm jealous of everybody. When I watched Janice to the hall, I was like, that's it, that's it. I'm going to go find one. But we don't have one in this town. Ugh, this town. Oh, for God's sake, it took me a half an hour to get here. I went in every strip mall, two other strip malls, and I didn't think about turning the GPS lady on. That would have been too smart. But look, there's a Dollar Tree. And behind this blue car is a Goodwill. Bonus, but just three blocks away is my favorite Walmart. <gasps> Score. Oh, I didn't get much, but I got some things. Um, it's a little shady at that dollar store coming out. Twice people started to approach me like to ask for money, and I just was like, get away from me. You know, that energy. But I did get some cool stuff. Oh, shortbreads. I love shortbread cookies. Some honey buns. That water I bought somewhere else. Two of the scrubby sponges. I like those. Some pear soap for the bathroom sink. Um, this was good. It smells really good. It's pumpkin pie. Little teeny candle. But I actually need it. Worcestershire shirt. Worcester shirt. Or Worcester. <laughs> Some people call it Worcester. I call it Worcestershire. Some people call it Worcestershire or something. I have no idea. Um, then some ketchup. That's a staple here for my grandson. I bought two rollerball pencil pins. I got a pack of um, triple A batteries. I need them for the keyboards. Then I don't know why I bought this cream. Um, I don't know. It just looked good. It was by uh, Aloe Vera Grace. Uh, yeah. Olivia. Aloe Vera. <laughs> I'm tired. It's just a set of two of hand cream put in my purse and I bought that somewhere else too. A pack of Tootsie Roll Pops. I love them. Then look at these. These are the cool um, full-size handkerchiefs. Uh, uh, Kleenexes to put in your pur purse. And I need some. Then I got two maroon towels for the kitchen and two I don't know what color that would be. Like an olive green uh, for the bathroom. So I still need, I'd like to buy some cream. I like cream things for the bathroom and everything. And then I went to Walmart, but it was so friggin' hot in there. I looked for the one shirt I wanted to find. Couldn't find it. And it was so hot, literally, I was sweating by the time I left. I could not believe that. Ugh. Uh, ouch. And, oh, and I have a broken computer. I'll tell you all about that in a minute. I need a cup of coffee. Hi, everybody. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh, oh. My company is finally gone. Not good. Every time I say that, somebody shows up. It's kind of like... Hey, you want to go to Claudie's? Hey, I'm going to Claudie's. It's like, well, yeah, I'll be there in a couple days. Okay, sounds fun. It's like, oh, hold on, tripod. Trouble with tripods. Trouble with tripods. Um, it's like, could anyone ask me about it? No, we're all such old friends that I would drop in on them. So, they can drop in on me. I'm so tired. <laughs> I don't wash all my towels because like I have like two I use 
well, four that I used, you know, I alternate them. And then I have like, so I guess if I'm using a set, then there are four extra sets. Uh, no, towels. Um, but hand towels, they, I don't, I don't know where hand towels have gone. Yeah, it's kind of like the spoons disappeared. Then the forks disappeared, and I know I have hand towels somewhere. They're not in my underwear drawer. I know that why they would be there, but God only knows. I might have stuck them there. <laughs> Me and my underwear. I seem to have a fetish about underwear lately. So, hey, so I am pooped, but of good cheer, please. Do not think I'm not of good cheer. I'm excellent. It's always lovely to visit with friends. And I'm so for I feel fortunate to have friends. But except I cried all the way home from I went to Walmart after I went to the dollar store, which is like it's it's not in my city. So I went to another city. But it's like, you know, it's kinda like you would think just the outskirts of mine and like we don't really have bad neighborhoods and not I'm, I'm not saying that to sound snooty or anything but we just don't uh, everybody's peace loving and tree huggers here remember um, the Stepford hippies as children's father called them uh, I mean we're the Perkins I mean we I swear to God, I even own Birkenstocks. That's how bad it is. Uh, <laughs> oh, 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 before I forget to tell you, Anita even saw it on the TV. They're getting rid of the bike lanes. Yay! They're actually been considered dangerous because it's not, they shortened the, you know, took it from four lane to two lane. But when they, did that they shortened the lanes and they are too narrow so it's like yay they're going away I mean even Anita heard about our bike lanes <laughs> it's pretty bad when Anita hears about them but like I feel a sense of ah, uh, yeah just I feel really good about that the bike lanes are out of here I mean for me to get on the street now, it's like a traffic jam. I mean, it's, it's like never been a traffic jam there. Um, so, it's <laughs> my life. <laughs> but I do. I live in the strangest city. <laughs> Did I ever tell you the Cadillac story? So, I was trying to, you know, I'm sure I probably have told you this, but when we first moved here, I moved here with my ex-husband and it's a very liberal town and his parents you know are very conservative ranchers <laughs> so I'm trying to prepare Anita because we're going to go downtown to go shopping and I'm like to the open mall because again we have no closed mall this is a brilliant concept for you know hot winter and freezing cold weather. You have to go to an outside mall to go shopping. We have not one, but two. They got rid of our big mall. Um, so I was trying to prepare Anita more for like people with mohawks, purple or pink or, you know, things like that when I said, you can just see anything here, Anita. So I'm in a turning lane and I'm turning left and she goes do you know that you can see anything she said look at next to us there was a brand new Cadillac with a llama in the back seat true story I swear you can ask Anita so <laughs> I just live in the weirdest town <laughs> but there was <laughs> brand new Cadillac had the sticker on the window beautiful gorgeous Cadillac with a llama in the back seat Call me crazy, but I wouldn't put the, my llama in the back seat of my car. Oh. So when I watched Janice, I said, that's it. There has to be a tree or something by me. And it was, 
it was okay they had about this much makeup literally they had like that much um but yeah and then some of the stuff like the pot pies are a dollar well they're cheaper at uh, they had some frozen food which I kind of freaked out I didn't really look at it closely and you know and they have a bunch of canned goods but I don't know what I need because I have to go through all my canned goods and if they're getting close to expiration then I put them up in the community share program um, and see what I need for winter because I'm like Janice a little bit of a survivalist myself um so I was watching Kathy A which we all love and adore and she's on guru gossip now I'm telling you girl if you get on guru gossip I think you've made it I discovered this board I don't know if I can find the video I'll actually link it below a long time ago and I just thought it was just like are you kidding me? These people go on to slam makeup gurus and non-makeup gurus. I mean, they just, they'll pick on anybody. Um, anybody. And uh, so, but I think if you're on that gossip board and they're talking about you, you've made it. Because I believe good news, bad news, as long as they're talking about you, who cares? <laughs> so, be proud, Kathy, that you're on Guru Gossip. Because it is definitely not a site that I can see any of us participating in. No. No. It's, um... I think people who need to get a hobby or... Um, need to get a hobby, need to possibly read a book, um, maybe clean their house. I don't know. I would not, I mean, I belong to several forums, but they're not that type of forums. Mine are more like, I don't know, computer forums. Oh, talk about computers. It is crying Bill here. Crying, crying Bill here. <sighs> My communal laptop, because I don't want anyone touching the good computers, um, no longer will get on the internet. So I don't know if it's the net card or if somebody... I don't know. I don't know. I think that's fixable. I'm not sure. But my, what I call my man-eater, it's my big giant small fortune computer that will do anything it'll do five things at once uh, <laughs> um, may have died and when I say died I mean I think it may be the CPU and the cost of that CPU I can just go buy a computer um, so, I don't know, it might be better just to buy two cheaper ones, um, because I need them, I need desktops and I need them for the stuff I do, uh, because I have two laptops, I don't need any more laptops, <laughs> I know, it sounds, it sounds crazy when you hear me say, I need five computers, <laughs> but I need one out here, two out here. I, I, I got interrupted, so I'm not sure where I was at. My rant over the computers. Uh, I'm telling you, I have to remember to order to buy a tripod. Well, anyway, I've got the kids' Netflix computer in my bedroom, so I'm going to have to figure out something and give them back their... They, they won't be happy. I mean, my granddaughter has learned to turn it on, code in, and find Netflix. <laughs> Ah, and then there's Mary Ellen. Mary Ellen has to change her name. The War of the Internet Names. Oh, it's never. You know, this has gone back to the, <laughs> my favorite is the guy, because in the beginning, people just bought up all sorts of names. And he happened to buy 
a very lucky name. Microsoft.com, and the guy would not let go of it. So Microsoft.com was not Microsoft.com for quite a few years. So somebody should look it up to see how much the guy, because he kept saying, <laughs> pay me and I'll give you your name. And I mean, who knows how much he ended up with, but ah, the war of the internet names. Um, there was even a dispute over one of the names I go by on the internet. It's a computer name, so it's not like, you know, it's like a alias. I was approached that I couldn't use that name, and but luckily I had documentation I was using it longer and also find out that they didn't register it, so I ran and registered it. <laughs> but I just, I don't like it. Um, um, but I think you ought to for sure have Mary Ellen in your thing. I like just Mary Ellen, but that's how, you know, but that's how we refer to you, so. And I think it's a ultra cool name being one name, two names into one. Uh, but, you know, like I'm Claudie being Claudie, so, you know, I think you have to indicate something about yourself. But, bummer, Mary Ellen. Well, you know, I need to go look at the computer. Because, see, it, it, I have this thing that, like, if it's made by man, it can be fixed by man. And, you know, I can fix this regardless. It's just, I may be faced with, you know, what is the most cost-effective thing for me to do? This computer that's broken, I know I can fix it. It was like, it just, it, it like, tumbled. And I'd say... No, I didn't get a virus because not any of them do the same thing. That's the problem why I need so many. <laughs> so, I'm going to, att it's getting late, I need to eat something and then probably attempt either tonight or tomorrow. I've started watching on Netflix this new thing, Between. It's about a town where everybody 22 and under lived and everybody over 22 died and now they're quarantined you know kind of like the dome um which i don't know. but i so far i'm on episode three um and i like it uh so you know i've got some new subbies um i'll check out your boards um which i think is a cool thing to do um and I had to unsubscribe to It's uh, Black Friday because I'm obsessed with her. <laughs> I'm totally obsessed with her. <laughs> like, what do you think? I mean, you know, because I'm used to watching you guys do makeup tutorials <laughs> to see her do one. It's like, but, I, you know, again, please don't think I'm making fun of her because I'm not. She's, I think, very unique and cool in her own way. But that girl has to go through a thing of eyeliner, what, a week? I mean, she must buy eyeliner by the, like, gobs. Like, it, she needs to buy the industrial cans or jar. I guess it would be jars or tubes. No, I think she's really kind of cool. I've watched, but I, I'm, I'm a little obsessed with her, so I'd, I'd subscribe. So, but... If you, I was watching this one girl that does shout outs once a week. And I really think it's cool. I'll have to try to remember and tell you next time what her name was. But, you know, I think it's really good for little boards like mine. Um, or good for anyone's channel. You know, boards. No, 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 no. Not talking about guru gossip. Well, anyway, I love you guys. Thanks for subscribing. Take care. Bye bye.